Hey guys, quick overview of the Mermaid on Coral layered background. I just wanted to quickly go through to show you what you can do to change it and what the layers are. So the first one you'll see, um, you won't see all of my copyrights. I'm doing this to protect my work. You'll see this turned off. Um, but the global layer up here, um, if you, you can turn these on and off, you can see at the bottom that warms it. This brings a little bit of um, attention to the center. This gives it vibrance. There's also sun flares here that you can open. There's the top one, and then there's the drops on the floor, the ocean floor here. And then I've got a, a main color layer to um, give the entire image an underwater feel. So that's the global layers of adjustments that you can um, modify yourself. Here's the seaweed. Now the seaweed is just the front uh, blurred foreground um, and you can turn that on and off. Then you have your fish and those um, including the bubbles. So you can move the bubbles as you see right here. Um, you can turn those on and off right there or you can move them. We've got the turtle here and that is the bubbles and the turtle as well. And again, you can move the turtle. Same with the seahorse and the bubbles of the seahorse. This is my sample um, mermaid that you'll put over um, the background and the background. The tail is not movable. It's part of the background. Um, so you will um, only need to put your person over that tail um, to, to blend. That's it. Um, so there it is. It's very simple. I made it so you can modify it a little bit, add to it or remove from it as you like. Um, and then obviously these bubbles here as well um, are also modifiable so that you can Hello. either copy them and um, put them over your model um, or you can remove them or add to them. So that's the Mermaid on Coral layered background. Um, get it at terramapes.com. And until next time, Stay enchanted.